Hello everyone, I'm Andy Liu from NHL Draft Central and today we'll take a quick look at my scouting notes from November 18th on 2021 NHL Draft eligible Manix Landry. Landry is a smooth skating center who showed the ability to both lead and disrupt transition attempts thanks to a strong blend of speed, agility and an enthusiast to put the extra effort. The left-handed center put on display nifty puck handling abilities and above average skating prowess throughout his rushers' opportunities. His fantastic agility empowers him to weave through skating lanes with finesse, and he finds clever paths to the offensive zone. Landry showcased a very versatile skill set tonight, not only being able to create offense on both the transition and cycle play, but also being able to act as either a playmaker or finisher. The Canadian center didn't really steal the show with outstanding skills, but he fused to the attack as well as anyone could have. He made the right passes to keep the play moving, got to his spot smartly, and kept a great tempo. Working in the middle slot on the power play, or simply sneaking his way there at 5v5, Landry got to showcase a very quick release in addition to an adequate accuracy on his wrist shot. His chances gave a lot of rebound trouble to the goaltender, who offered a few second and opportunities near the crease. As a center whose skill set primarily fits the offense, it's encouraging to see his commitment to backchecking. He has developed great habits, always putting the extra effort to close out on attackers and disrupt counterattacks with his stick and body. His wonderful motor goes both ways as Landry showed thrilling, relentless effort on the puck pursuit. Although defensively responsible, he did make a few careless no-look passes on zone exits, leading to a couple of turnovers. Landry doesn't have the creativity, elusiveness or swagger of a top prospect, but his versatile skill set, joined with his tremendous competitive spirit, makes him a very attractive option in the middle round. I think we could see him develop into a skilled, well-rounded bottom six forward at the next level if he continues on his progression. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.